You're watching Two Button Crew. The Daily Show. For <laughs> dang it. Okay, let's. I hate this. Okay. <laughs> You're watching Two Button Crew. Your daily Nintendo of fandom. Yeah, get that dose. Mm. Get a taste of your own medicine. This is Pokin Week, it's been a blast, and today we're gonna uh, probably be the most complainy little babies. We're gonna ever be been whiny on babies. Our Nintendo, you gave us an awesome game, but it has a problem, and we're gonna whine about it. Yeah. Do you think this kept us from giving it a 10? We scored it at 8.75. I think the facial hair. The uh, facial well, hair is what yeah. kept me from giving it a 10. But Sorry, yeah, so this this is one of the big problems yeah. of Pokémon Tournament. If you don't know what we're talking about, like try to play Pokémon Tournament local. Someone uh, has to use the gamepad because there's no split screen. That way someone has the TV and someone has the gamepad. No uh, split screen. No split screen. The frame rate drops from 60 to 30, and you don't want that in your fighting game. No. And then uh, you might not necessarily have all your stuff unlocked. So, yeah. they, so they put in LAN mode, which is gonna require two Wii U's, two games, LAN adapters, cables, and potentially routers, and all that, just so you can have your own TV and your own game, your own 60 frames per second. Can I just tell you a little story? Tell, tell okay. me a story. Listen up to this, guys. No joke, no lie. This is my life. Last night, okay, I was asleep. Sound asleep. <laughs> oh my gosh. 6.30 a.m. this morning, bolt upright. I am waking up from a nightmare that all of the Wii U LAN adapters were sold out countrywide. Oh my goodness. I was in a cold sweat, Simeon. <laughs> No, no, no! <laughs> Were you gonna like go break into somebody's house or something? <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is this is ridiculous. So, so there's three options. Well, land mode's not even on the menu. You gotta put yeah. in the Konami code. Yeah, you you had to do a secret menu. <laughs> yes. Like I don't even know. Is that? I'm sure it's probably in the manual how to do this. I don't know. But uh, at least in the in-game yeah. manual for sure. I don't even know if it came with a printed manual. Yeah, like what? But what? 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 Okay, option one. Two Wii U's, two Pokemon Tournament software, two TV monitors, and those are the requirements for all of these options. Mm -hmm. um, you also needed two Wii U LAN adapters for all of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, so option one. Two straight LAN cables and a router. A router? Yep, you need a router. Which? In, in, in option one, to connect. Yeah. So, so you can't just... Say, oh, here's a cable. No, you know, here's a cable. Connect them together, and we're and then good. you can get issues if other people are on your network connecting, getting the right matchup. Yes. Option two. Option two is the same stuff, but a wireless router. Mm -hmm. Which I mean, if you're just getting together to have fun with some friends, and you don't want to. Well, if you're just getting together to have some fun with some friends, you're gonna just play on the gamepad. Yeah. Who who's gonna use the wireless router and, option? And suffer the lag. Yeah, just for the experience maybe, but here's option three. Okay. <sighs> Buckle in because <laughs> this is a doozy. So you got your TVs and your games and your controllers and all that. And your adapters, but you connect the adapters with a crossover cable. Which now we found out. You might just be learning about this cable right now. Yes, we we had no idea what that was. <clears throat> yeah, we we thought it was just you know at least I thought it was just like a regular um, Ethernet. Ethernet cable. But no, it's got special insides. Yeah, it's got s s different insides, and we went to a store. Well, we wanted this because I didn't want to mess yeah. with the router. I didn't want to break my home connection. To no, carry this hardware with me. That's ridiculous. Yeah. So we went to go All get the... All the PC gamers are like, you guys. You guys. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We, we probably have PC gamers that are like, yeah. you guys are noobs. Like, yes. we know this already and you're being a whiny baby and just get used to it. But 
you just realize that we're console gamers and we have never had to deal with anything like this no. and we this is why we're console gamers so we don't have to well nintendo think. doesn't do stuff like this no like the poke the pokemon company made this happen nintendo yes. would never say the word router yeah you know what i'm saying yeah so we were putting on this event and we needed these setups so. yes so we went to the st store several stores um, to find the adapters, first of all, and then cables to connect it. And you said that it um, needed a crossover cable. So It's the best, most reliable way to do it. It's no network. It's just the Wii U's plugging together. Straight straight together. Yeah. So we we go to the store and we say, do you have any crossover cables? Because their, <laughs> their adapters were too expensive, so we were going to order those online. Yeah. Do you have any crossover cables? And the guy says, I don't think we have any of those. Your best bet is to go to Home Depot. Can I stop you for a second? Yes. Let's get to that. I <laughs> want to point out that like he took us to go look. And before before we know it, like five. Uh, five associates. Five best buy geniuses or whatever. What are they called? The Geek Squad? <laughs> like five of them. Were there. And they're like, we have this. And I was and it's like, no, that's a normal network cable. Do you have yeah. crossover cables? So like, well, I don't know what that is. Let's see. Let's call Bob over here. And yeah. Bob was like, we have those. No, crossover cables. I don't know what crossover cables Let's are. call Tim. Yes. And Five of those bros. Yeah. And so they eventually said, we don't think it's going to work. Your best bet is to go to Home Depot, cut from the spool of wire, your own wire, and <laughs> solder the, the thing together yourself. That is their was their advice to us, and because there apparently nobody sells crossover cables except Amazon. Uh, go and make your own. Cable. <laughs> that was their solution to us. This is how ridiculous oh. that this game is made. That we have to go to Home Depot. <laughs> we have to. They told us to go to Home Depot so that we could play Pokemon. <laughs> How ridiculous is that? That does not follow, people. We're going to the home improvement okay. store to get our yeah. video games working. So, so that's that's not even the end of the story. Um, so you you have to connect your Wii U's together, and then yeah, like we got them off Amazon because we weren't gonna go do all that noise. No. Show up at the event. So we have to go, both Wii U consoles, we go to the system settings, internet, connect to the internet, press Y to select the wired connection, because you're using yes. crossover cables. Choose the LAN adapter, um, a communication test will begin and fail. Yes. And that's good. Yes. It's supposed Failing to fail good. in this setup. You press OK to see the error results. You press X to load up the internet connection setup and go to the details of the connection. Here's where this gets crazy. You set the IP address to 192.168.000.001. You set the subnet mask to 255.255.255.000, and then the gateway to 1.92, same as the IP address, except the last digits are 0 .050. And then the Wii U will ask you to set up DNS servers. Do not auto obtain, put the 0, 0 0.1 and then three sets of three zeros. And then you press B to save the settings. Then, uh, yeah. I barely know what an IP address is. I don't know what a subnet mask, a gateway, or, or Primary really DNS. DNS is. I know yeah. it, it's, I don't know it's what domain are. name server or something. I, but like, what I is that? I have no idea. Why do I'm I have really... to do all this? So, so we're setting this up. At, at the tournament and we're trying to we get all this going we have this uh great guy tasman he's he's helping us out and we're sitting there and he's saying no whammies no whammies <laughs> uh and we're we're trying to get this to work and it doesn't work yeah and so literally i think i think there could have been one more step if we if we didn't get this literally the solution was he's like well, let's try turning it off and turning it back on again. <laughs> and that worked, okay? We had to turn it back off and that's, then turn it back on again. That's what Unwhammy did. Yes. And I think the once you get to that step and and that doesn't fix it and you've done everything else, then I think the only, the last step... Do you know what the last step is? No. Smacking the Wii U console. <laughs> like, that is... It's like... 
turning it off and turning it back on again is yeah. what fixed it. So I mean, it's ridiculous. Were, were you shopping by yourself before I was helping with uh, for just the adapters, the Ethernet Wii adapters? I I went to GameStop and they didn't have any. Walmart didn't have any. Yeah, Wal Walmart had one, but it was super expensive. It was USB 3.0. And same with Best Buy. Same with Best so Buy. We Super had to expensive. thank thank goodness for Amazon for uh, they didn't have like the short crossover cable we needed. We had to get like ten feet of it. Or whatever. Yes, but it was okay. And then the two adapters. So if Walmart's, GameStops, and Best Buys aren't carrying the things that this poking game needs for LAN, I think it should have been uh, offered by Nintendo or like yes. a bundle with the game or something. Something we had Please. to instead we get the stupid. <clears throat> Stupid controller. It's a stupid controller. How stupid is okay? This is they could have made a fight stick for this and made a bundle of money on that. Instead they have this stupid little oh, we, we made we, we made an SNES controller for our arcade machine. <laughs> and we then we put it on console. Did it backwards. Put a yeah. Why? They could have been smart with this game. Yeah. However fantastic Pokemon Tournament is, and it is fantastic, think, and you well, should get it. I think it's really saying something about the game, that we love it, although we have to put up with all yes. this. So. There you go. Anybody else have fun uh, Pokemon Land experiences? We would love to hear how you're enjoying the game, you know, if you've tried playing it in competitive settings, how that's gone for you, and all that stuff. Yes, and... Yeah, go go ahead and, and comment. Also, feel free to become part of the crew. Hit the big red subscribe button and become part of the crew. Yes, there are literally hundreds of us. There's join hundreds. join the ranks. <laughs> Thanks so many of us. Thanks for watching. Thanks for enjoying Pokin Week. We'll see you next time. Signing out.